Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Just talk to this guy up here quickly. Hello you. You seem sad, stranger. I heard you mention a flood. Yes, a sudden deluge without rain or melt to explain it. I'm Lao Lai, the drummer of Deep Din. Or at least I was, until it disappeared under the waters. Deep Din? What's that? A hollow, carved out by the old ones. A chamber, a basin, and a musical instrument all at once. My life, my calling. I'd explain it by playing for you if I could. But its pipes are deep under the water now. So Deep Din is a place and a musical instrument? Yes. Pipes that carry a perfect tone beneath a sonorous basin. A wondrous edifice the old ones used to carry music far and wide. During the war, my father played the pipes to rally the Banuk against the Karja. I'm the drummer now. But our battles are few and far between. Mostly I play for the joy of it. Or to remember my family. Of course, if the waters don't recede, what's the point of joy? Or remembering. So the waters came fast. One day it was dry. The next, the nearby river had risen and the entire basin was flooded. I don't understand it. There was no rain, not even any clouds, and yet the river rose higher than I'd ever seen it. And there it remains. A flood without rain. That is strange. Where is this place? I'll have a look if I'm in the area. Just northwest of here. Look all you like, but I don't see what good it'll do. The floodwaters aren't going anywhere. How does one ask a river to relent? Sounds like somebody set up, set up a dam somewhere. Waterlogged, Shaman's Path. Hello. Why are you a different colour? Ooh. Alright, blue gem. Okay. You only trade in blue gems. Okay, interesting. Alright, fair enough. Where am I going? Find Noltuk. Alright, first I think I'll go for this tall neck and get this area cleared up. Can I go... Nope, this is the way. God, this area is going to have even more side quests. Are we ever going to finish this game? Who knows? Right. See so if we can find this tall neck. Be around here somewhere. Oh, a tonic? What did it take to knock one of those over? They're about to last. Oh, blimey. This might be the easiest tall neck to climb. Encased in ice. 
from a long time ago. The scavengers have just gotten started. Where'd you come from? Jesus. See how deep the damage goes. Oh. I didn't realize I could do that. Skills, right, what's this? Concentration, that would be useful. Double shot. This one will aim in to notch an additional arrow. Okay, knock down. Heavy spear attacks will knock down machines faster. Combat override, increases the time machine will remain overridden indefinitely. Okay, disarm traps. Ammo crafter. Machine repair, repair an overridden machine. Order, increase resource. Ah, are you, I'm gonna go for that one. No room. Well, that didn't last. If I can't find something, maybe my focus can. It looks like the scavengers ripped out three major parts. If I could bring them back, maybe I could even reactivate it. Get it what's inside its head. Okay. Where are these parts? They're all around, scattered around here. Of course they are. Get my uh, ammo back up.
get you all? Excellent. What are you? Can't carry more. This tall part's still in one piece. Oh, I see. Each of these sites is going to have more machines. Fair enough. I don't think I've had to rebuild a machine in order to uh, get what I need from it. Okay, you're down here now. Ugh, the scrapes. Drop, Aloy. I want you to drop down. There we go. Sod off. What the fuck is this? Just as well, I got plenty of uh, health stored up. Another part over here. how it's done heart seems attacked till next real tough all right let's get back to the tall neck now i hope you haven't all respawned i should be very angry no you're all good Got to put them back in certain places. Okay. Oh, it's in better shape than it was. Okay, I'm right. We just need to get the power flowing through. If I'm wrong, at least no one's watching. Yeah, I can't imagine our tribe would be very happy with us uh, reactivating a machine. Right, it's never easy. 
No, it never is. I mean, we could have just jumped on it while it was getting up. I should be able to jump onto the tall neck from here. Whoops. Oh, Jesus, that took a lot of my health. Well, we'll, we'll wait for you to come back round. So, anyway, how are you all doing? <laughs> Hope you are doing good. I mean, there's another. Oh, there was another bit over there I could have. No, you don't need to. You, there's really no need for you to come over here. Breath is ice before I even breathe out. Is he, is, he coming, is he actually coming back? Yes, he's over there. Ready there we go. Can't have those gits lying around. Here he is, he's finally back. Took your time, buddy, took your time. I'm in no rush, and it's only snowing. It's only minus 112. There we go. Made it. Now to climb up to its head. We got this, Aloy. There we go. That's this area declouded. Apart from this area here, uh, we've got another cave to explore. Nice. That should provide us with some more details as to why this world has gone to pot. But yeah, we can undo you now. You're done. Waterlogged. Alright. Let's crack on with our main mission. And then after that, we can do the waterlogged one. What's that? I should, I probably, should probably be reading those, but... Yeah. Right, Naltuk, are you up here? That must be Naltuk looking out of that tower. It looks like it's in What the hell is that? Naltuk? Who are you? How did you find me? Bergrind told me you'd be out here. He's persistent. I've told that Asaram a thousand times. I don't need to buy anything. And I'm not selling. I just need to find Araya. Well, you won't. She's gone where only shamans can tread. She seeks guidance from the voice in the blue light. That is her task. And the task she gave me is to observe the daemon's work. To stop it spreading, if I can. 
What can I do about these towers? In only a few weeks, they've sprouted throughout the cut. The demon's energy pulses from them, rallies the machines, even repairs them. Repairs them, eh? Our talks of this demon was frenzying machines. Look there, those with the purple markings, they belong to the demon. They're stronger, more dangerous. I've seen something like this before, a corruption. But it wasn't from your daemon. You have? Well, then you know more than I do. These towers, were they part of your corruption? No. Those are new to me, too. Like I said, they empower the daemon's machines. They must be stopped. Will you tell me where Array went? You ask a lot of questions. Only when I'm not getting the answers I need. There's but one voice Aurea wants to hear right now, and it isn't yours. I'm sorry. All right, you want to stop the spread of the Daemon's work? I know how to get started, with my bow and spear. Outlander, wait. Won't you tell me your name? Aloy. Good. If you fall to the Daemon's machines, at least I can properly recount your efforts to Aurea. Thanks for the vote of confidence. <laughs> I won't fall. And when I'm done, you're gonna tell me where she is. God, Aloy, you're such a badass. Aloy is very quickly becoming one of my favourite characters. I can kill the machines. Now what? Oh, I need to actually kill the machines now. Where is it? Ah, oh, there it is. Take these. So we can override it, that's good to know. You are quite the warrior. I try. Seems I can take care of the machines and towers. The daemon's next. You claimed its power for yourself somehow. Perhaps Aurea should meet you after all. What she truly seeks is hope. After what I just saw, you could show her that. She's in retreat beyond those mountains, the ice rasps. You'll have to walk the shaman's path to get there. You'll know you've reached the end when you come to a shrine, 
a great machine covered in blue gleam. Shamans who complete the path take a piece of it as reward. If you make it that far, you should too. You'll have earned it. You said something about blue gleam at the end of the shaman's path? A crystal that builds on the bodies of machines in the oldest ice. We Banuk believe it's the stuff of the blue light, frozen as it escapes their shells. You might be more interested that merchants will trade well for it. Bergren told me you're Araya's apprentice. In her absence, I serve the chieftain and his Werak as an advisor, a scout, a speaker for the blue light. A lot of responsibilities. I don't know if I can live up to Araya's example, but I have to try. I owe her that much. She took a chance on me, an aspiring shaman from the edge of the world. No one else would. Were you with Araya when they attacked the mountain? I wish I had been. Even with all that happened. I'm no warrior, though. So she bid me wait. When Orea and the Chieftain returned, I saw them argue bitterly. I don't know what about exactly. Then she came to me, gave me my task, and left us. How do I cross this shaman's path? Go to the ice rasps. Then follow the markers through the ice caves and the waterfalls, and make the climb to the shrine. But be careful. The path is meant to be an ordeal, the final trial of a young shaman's training. And I'll find Araya at the end of it? No. She goes further up, somewhere inside the mountain. If you see her, would you tell her... I have faith she will hear the voice again. Fair enough. All right. Okay, so we're going that way. For that mission, we've got that mission, which is on our route. Excellent. So let's go to this campfire. Right. I guess I'm after the ice rasps to find this shaman's path. Look at that tall git. At least they don't attack you. Not intentionally, anyway, they just walk their circle. I've been trampled on once, but that's because I'm an idiot. Oh, yeah, need to restock my uh, health pouch. Right, where's this campfire? That's over here. I think we've done enough for this episode so i'm going to end this one here thank you very much for taking the time to watch this guys if you liked it like subscribe ding that bell i've been sick later this has been horizon zero dawn and i'll catch you next time take care now <laughs>